Today I'm going to show you how to change out your air filter on your Polaris General. Mother son of a... <laughs> Today I'm going to show you how to change out the air filter on your Polaris General. Let's get to it. With the cargo bed up, we have access to the air box and to remove this lid, we're gonna undo these two rubber straps, rock the lid down. It's held in place by these tabs at the bottom. Make sure you get those released, pull it out of the way. And then we can simply remove the air filter by pulling it out. At this point, we're gonna inspect the air filter. That way you know if it needs to be replaced or not. First thing I'm gonna look for is any signs of obvious damage. If there's any tears in the paper or any damage to the sealing surface, you definitely wanna get this replaced. If you don't see any damage, the next check you wanna make is if this thing is caked with dirt, because if it is, your engine is not gonna breathe like it should. So first thing I'm gonna do is hold it up to some light and I'm gonna look for light coming through the pleats or the pleating in that filter. And an easy way to do this is just to compare it to a new filter. So our new filter has a lot more light coming through and it's about time to get this thing replaced. Last thing I'm gonna do is tap this on the table and see how much dirt actually comes out because it might be hard to see from there, but I can see right here, there's a ton of dirt packed up in this. So you can see just from dropping that, we've got quite a bit of dirt coming out and it definitely could be worse, but with this having dirt packed up in there, we're just gonna get it replaced. Now, some people will try to tap these out and try to run them one more time, but really it's just cheap insurance to install a new air filter and that way you know you don't have dirt getting sucked into the engine and damaging it. Now I'm gonna install the new air filter. This one is from All Balls and it's gonna be great for anyone riding in just standard conditions and using their machine for standard use. But if you're in super dusty conditions, you can check out a Donaldson filter. If you need either of these, you can click the link in the description below. It's gonna take you to our website. We've got those options on there. So with the air filter in place, you wanna make sure it is fully seated. And then you can install the air filter cover. Now I've already gone ahead and cleaned this out and I've checked the gasket all the way around. It's in good condition. So all I need to do now is line up the tabs in the bottom and then install those two rubber straps on the top. And that's how easy it is to get this nasty air filter changed out of your Polaris General. It's simple to do. And again, if you need one, click the link in the description below. Now, if you have any questions, leave me a comment and subscribe to our channel for more helpful content. I'm Charles with Rocky Mountain ATVMC. Thanks for watching.